Hi guys, it's Vanessa. This is actually a video specifically for um, Mel for makeup. I was just watching her video, her haul video, and she had talked about how she got a Lancome eyeshadow and it was a biatch to depot. And when I heard her say that, I was like, you can depot Lancome eyeshadows. This is the only one I own and I love it. Um, New Black. As you can tell, I've had it for a while. But um, I was like, oh, I'm all about depotting because I have like all of these and the least I could have the better so I just tried depotting it and it worked pretty fast so I'm going to explain what I did since it's the only one I can't redo it um, and sorry if it's a little shaky this is the best way um, for you to see that I hold the camera so what you're going to need of course is your usual depotting tools some rubbing alcohol this is um, like a nail file I used to have a tip but it literally broke in this process but you know just something like pretty thin that you can use to pry it out and then an eyedropper really helps for this so what you're going to do is when you first open this you're going to look at the edges and this is going to be hard to do with one hand but basically you're going to try to find the edge that you can like you know get this in there as much as possible so you're going to move it around a little and kind of like widen the gap around the eyeshadow my camera doesn't really focus well but there should be a gap somewhere in this perimeter. Next, you're just going to take some um, rubbing alcohol, sorry, in your dropper, and you're going to start um, dropping it in there. And you want to kind of, when you do it, you want it to be on the crack, and then like, and then coming off the container. Try to get it away from the eyeshadow because obviously it's going to make your eyeshadow really soft and crumbly and whatnot. So once you do that, um, you're going to let it sit, kind of move it around, and then um, I do it a couple of times. So you're going to let it sit, move it around, let it sit, move it around. Then you're going to take this and you're going to put it back in that little opening. And then you're going to tilt the shadow, not so much this because this will snap in half. Um, you're just going to tilt it and then it'll, it'll just come right out. Here's mine. And then, you know, clean the back and add your um, thing and put it in your palette. So, I know this was kind of a crappy explanation, but no heat required. And literally, girl, it took me like two minutes, if that much. I'm going to link, um, actually, I got the, the way to do this off of another YouTube, and I never remember the names, darn. But I'll link her. Um, she has it, and she shows how to do it with the Wet n Wild, but it's the same process. So, I hope that helps, girl. Um, that's about it. Alrighty guys, bye.